Welcome, welcome, well. So if you're clicking this video, you're probably wondering how to become a leaderboard player in the bridge. And if you don't know, I'm currently number 14 on the all-time bridge leaderboards. So yeah, and yes, I'm trying to get as much content out of this as possible. So please just go with it. And also just because I'm on a leaderboard doesn't mean I'm necessarily the best player, but I'm like decent. And before this video starts, if you could like leave a like, subscribe, and comment, that'd be great because I need subscribers. Oh my god. Yeah, so I hope you guys enjoy the video. Uh, I'm just gonna go into a few bridge games and talk about how to get on the leaderboards and stuff. And yeah. Alright, so if you don't know, which you probably do by now, I've just recently added these bridge leaderboards. Yeah. He 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 knows what's up. Yeah, so I added bridge leaderboards about like three days ago. So I think to get on the leaderboard, you have to get around, I think it's 30 wins, which is super easy. Like if you want to get on the leaderboard, right now is the time to grind. Okay. Okay, so basically the high bridge leaderboards are measured by how many times you win. And it also has to be in solos. Like your dual stats, they do not matter. Also for kits, the only thing you can use is a leap. Like, I hate the leap, but it has to be done since every single person uses it. Because, like, every single top person uses the leap. And it's almost impossible to counter it with just snowballs. Like, you're gonna be decent. You can be decent with snowballs and, like, get, like, a decent rank on the leaderboards. But you're most likely not gonna be top 20. Unless you're, like, severely dedicated. Like, I don't even know how you do that stuff. Uh oh. Alright, we're chilling. He was close. It's okay, pizza boy. One, two, one, one, white. Like, honestly, I prefer to use snowballs, and I'm actually probably better with snowballs. But to rack up wins super quick for, like, leaderboards, you're gonna have to use a leap. Yeah, so if you wanna get on a leaderboard, you have to start now, basically. Because people are already going crazy with, like, wins. Like, some kid already has, like, 500 in, like, three days, which is, like, unhealthy. So. <laughs> This guy's creating a top hat too, but it shouldn't matter, so let's go around. Where did my audio go? No, let's go and just go. Thank you very much. Yeah, so I know that that was just mostly a commentary, but basically the things to take away on how to get into like a leaderboard position is to start now, basically. Like, you can like scroll down a bit on this video and see like when I posted this. If it's like five days from now you're too late i mean technically you could still get on it somehow but it's gonna be a lot harder than if you did start like right now when this video is posted so the other thing to take away is use a leap like i know the leap is like terrible and it needs to be removed but every single top player uses it and if you're just using snowballs like you saw in the last game i played it's not gonna work so use a leap and start now on the leaderboards and you should be chilling you should get like a nice leaderboard position hopefully if you liked it, please consider subscribing because I have no subs and no viewers, so help me out. Yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate you guys. And. Why does this happen every single video? Bye.